and my name is Ronan O'Connell. I'm Professor of Surgery at University College Dublin. Cancer of the large bowel is common and in Ireland affects approximately 1 in 50 adults, sometime in their lifetime. Most patients are over the age of 50 and the risk of developing colon cancer increases with age. Those with a family history of large bowel cancer may be at increased risk. And so, if you are aware of a family member with a diagnosis of large bowel cancer, it is important to check with your own doctor whether or not you might be at increased risk. Most colorectal cancers develop from polyps, which are wart-like growths of the lining of the bowel. Particular types of polyps are more prone to become cancerous. However, if removed, cancerous change can be prevented. Even if a cancer has developed, early diagnosis is important as the disease is usually cured by surgical removal of the affected part of the bowel once the tumour has not spread beyond the bowel wall. It is on this basis that a cancer screening programme will be introduced in Ireland in 2012. The symptoms of large bowel cancer can be subtle. However, possible signs include a change of bowel habit, particularly if there's been no change in diet, passing blood in the stool, a feeling of not being able to empty the bowel completely, abdominal or tummy cramps, bloating, and a feeling of being very tired, as this may be due to blood loss. Bowel cancer is diagnosed by physical examination and rectal examination by your doctor and colonoscopy or special x-rays. If an abnormal area is found, a sample known as a biopsy is taken and is examined in the laboratory. The treatment for colorectal cancer is generally very successful. It usually involves surgical removal, which nowadays is often done using a laparoscopic or keyhole technique. Chemotherapy and radiotherapy are sometimes recommended, particularly for patients with rectal cancer. If you have concerns that you or a family member may be at risk or have worrying symptoms, then do contact your doctor. Remember, the earlier the diagnosis is made, the better the chance for cure.